Hello friends, I am Manish Anand. The RaisinaHills.com brings to you daily analysis of the editorials carried in India's five top English newspapers. Friends, the Aam Admi Party has appointed its Rajya Sabha MP Raghav Chatta as the head of an advisory panel for the Punjab government that has been commented upon by the Indian Express. There has been a very, a very unfortunate incident during the Amarnath Yatra in which 70, 17 people lost their lives. This again has been commented by Deccan Herald. Friends, it's a fact that 70% of the people who are in the prisons are there languishing for months and years because they are not able to procure bills from the judicial proceedings and in this context the suggestion of the Supreme Court that there should be a comprehensive bail law has been very exhaustively commented upon by the Times of India. So we are broadly going to focus on these three topics in our today's editorial analysis. Friends, Popular perception remains that Punjab Chief Minister Bhagwant Maan takes instructions from the bosses in the Aam Admi Party from Delhi. That has gained further credence after the Aam Admi Party appointed Raghav Jada to head a temporary advisory panel for the Punjab government. The Indian Express has commented in its edit, quote, Chandigarh tight rope, unquote, on the decision of the Aam Admi Party referring to the charges of the Maan government being remote controlled while also reminding the past of Punjab when there used to be a British resident commissioner after the Sikh Empire lost much of its strength. The Daily cautions Ahmadmi Party to treat with caution or risk upsetting a state that is known to love and rebel with an equal passion. Unquote. True, the Ahmadi Party is new in the hot seat in Punjab after sweeping the assembly elections held earlier this year. The party claiming to be a proponent of an alternative politics has shown strikes of conventional mainstream politics that Indian Express has avoided mentioning. The Aam Admi Party also has a high command consisting of a few persons at the top consisting of Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal, his deputy Manish Sisodia and Chada. While there are a few who want to enter this coveted coterie such as Sanjay Singh, the Rajya Sabha MP of the party, the Indian Express editorial is quite mild in critiquing the decision of the Aam Admi Party to impose Chadha on the Maan government. The decision, in fact, amounts to lack of trust by the top brass of the Aam Admi Party in the ability of Maan, who was chosen the chief ministerial candidate after a phone-in survey in the run-up to the polls. Equally significant is the Indian Express missing out in mentioning that Chadda had micromanaged the Punjab elections for the Aam Admi Party and he was the key person who decided on the candidate list of the Aam Admi Party. Interestingly, the Aam Admi Party had picked up just one Sikh that was Harbhajan Singh, the legendary spinner as candidate out of five Rajya Sabha nominees just after the assembly election results. That also suggests the approach of the Aam Admi Party for its Punjab government. The Indian Express indeed shies away from stating that the Aam Admi Party is just another political party in the country and is equally afflicted with all the vices. Friends, Death of 17 pilgrims during the Amarnath Yatra has been commented upon by Deccan Herald in its edit. Quote, Yatra deaths could have been avoided, unquote, and puts the Jammu and Kashmir administration in the dock for failing to make full proof arrangements for the pilgrimage which commenced after a three years gap. Indeed, a large number of meetings had taken place ahead of the commencement of Yatra. The daily rightly questions the decision of the set, decision of the setting up of the tents at a place where there had been flash floods 
last year, which was again hit by the cloud bursts, which left 17 people dead. Deccan Herald reminds that the holy Amarnath cave is surrounded by glaciers and is vulnerable to the adverse weather patterns. The Jammu and Kashmir administration's failure to capture the aggravating weather pattern, noted DH, is also worrisome. In fact, India is yet to put in place a robust policy framework for the safe, safe pilgrimage to the popular destinations such as Chaudham Yatra, which warrants planning aligned with the changing weather patterns on account of the climate change. The police and the other enforcement agencies in, in, in India, friends, have been, seeking, have been seen working with colonial mindsets resorting to arrests even in instances when they are not required, subjecting taxpayers to much harassments at the hands of the inspectors, impounding of documents which may not be needed by the investigative agencies. These are, the such, these are some of the examples of the excesses on the count of the investigative agencies. In this backdrop, the Times of India, in its edit, quote, Bail is in our courts, unquote, has dwelt upon the suggestion of the Supreme Court for a comprehensive law on bail, arguing that 70% of the inmates in jails belong to the poor socio-economic strata of the society. The Daily rightly mentioned that the judicial officials and the police are in the habit of denying bails. The Supreme Court's direction that bail applications be disposed of in two weeks is timely, while the daily reminds of the 2014 Arnesh Kumar judgment, which called for the police to record specific reasons for arresting an accused. The conduct of the, the, conduct of the judicial officials and the police truly need reviews, but it, it remains a fact that neither the parliament nor the state assemblies have shown any urgency to address such issues. So friends, uh, indeed, uh, the police uh, action and the judicial court uh, courts uh, after uh, uh, actions on uh, the, the arrested people indeed require a thorough examination by the parliament and in that context a comprehensive bail law is timely and much needed. So this was for the today's daily analysis of the editorials carried in five top newspapers of India. You may share your feedback in the comment and uh, do share the link with your friends uh, and also subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much.